like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe, and join the membership for exclusive content in the description. Do you want me to give you another spanking? Yes! Hello, gentlemen. We are back at it yet again. I appreciate everyone who tunes in every single day. And hits the thumbs up, man. Helps the channel grow. Helps us get put in the algorithm and uh, all that good stuff, man. So I appreciate all you guys who uh, are the reason the channel grows little and little by every day. All right, so you've seen the title. The title of this video is something along the lines of estrogens act bratty so you put them in their place so you discipline them all right so we're going to be using some clips from around the 1940s um to just prove that point yet again and you know when you're dealing with estrogens and you're like what why does she keep doing these things and i gotta like do this and it's, it's because estrogens want to feel beneath you it's just their nature it's always been their nature they claim that men are uh besides the stupidest <laughs> all right but what do they always say when you ask them what type of man that they want? A man that's smarter than them. A man that makes more money than them. So guess who's the besides of stupidness? Them. Right? But they see, what it, what it is, is it's word game manipulation, man. It's, it's, it's fee-fail propaganda. They just don't want you to walk around like, yeah, I'm better than estrogens, right? So they want you to be better than them, but like, don't say it too loud. Do you understand? That's, that's what they want because estrogens don't want to lose beneficial equal rights right they they want to throw away all the hard equal rights but they don't want to lose beneficial equal rights like being able to shop on their own and work their own jobs and go outside late at night and things like that so that's that whole game but you've definitely dealt with estrogens and seeing this where they just will act irrational they'll just do little things that she you know she knows she shouldn't do that you can't allow and they do that so you can then check them and put them in their place because estrogen's nature has always been needing men to survive in the wild in the jungle in a civilization so what they do is they're testing you to see if you'll stand up to her because if you'll be able to stand up to her with the way that she's going to be doing the testing, you'll be able to stand up to the world. And deep down in their nature, they need to know that you'll be able to lead and guide her and the newborn children you two would create. So they do these little brattiness things. There's a line that you must allow, right? Because they can't go too far. They go too far, you leave them, but they're just going to do it. They, they like poking that bear because you have to also understand that estrogens used to, just like how you see animals uh, fight each other, for estrogens like different estrogen animals that's what they kind of they used to see us going hunt and be strong and things like that so they don't see that like in today's time because we're just in a huge intelligence culture time where it's all about being smart and not just physical so they want to see like strength and dominance and things like that estrogens are still <clears throat> they're still very uh, like innate and animalistic Right. Even though we live in different times, they still seek for this super strength type of thing. All right. So let's get into this. Right. That they do things. However, I title this video. They act bratty. So you discipline them and put them in their place, which is beneath you. So let's get into it. Let's turn this down. Oops. Let's do this. And then that. All right. Let's go. Back on men or men. 1940s. Well, well, well. The room looks bigger with the furniture moved, doesn't it, Mr. Jackson? Uh-huh. I'm sorry, Mr. Jackson. It was me who called Major Lynn. I mean, it was I. I didn't think it was your mother. I didn't know it was going to be this bad. You don't know how bad it really is. No! 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 You a great deal more no! than hurting me. Uh, so, yeah. So, you know, you know, estrogen's doing estrogen. She, she did something she was not supposed to do. Right? Um, and you know, it was just regular that a man would just spank estrogens, man, in the community, anywhere. It was just no, and, and no man would bat an eye, right? If you go to these other countries and stuff like that, like, it's a complete, just different culture, man. Like, it's just known that estrogens do little estrogen things that don't make sense and that are just irrational and just an emotional decision that she knows she wasn't supposed to do. And if you allow her to get away with doing what she's not supposed to do, well, now she doesn't respect you as a man. Right, they that they, they that's just twenty four seven dealing with estrogens. They going they're going to do something they know they shouldn't have done, because they know you can't allow it. And if you allow it, she's going to get worse and worse and worse, and your man is going to be disrespected. And estrogen, your wife, any estrogen is not over your manhood. A man's manhood must always stay intact, and when a man's manhood stays intact, that's when the family is in order. All right. So, but that was the daughter to to the the. 
the mother and things like that. But still, that just goes and shows, like, let's say, whatever, they were married, obviously, legally and stuff like that. Let's not be dumb in the comments. But... That was just regular, man. As I've shown in my previous videos, just they just do something, you know, incorrect. They know the man's the authority, and they just, you know, they just got spanked, and that's just what it was. Like the man is the disciplinary, discipline, disciplinarian. Estrogens are the ones that go, oh, you can do whatever you want. Ooh, don't be too hard on him. Da -da 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 -da. Like, but men understand you have to show your children that life is not easy you can't just do whatever you want and there's no consequences you say the wrong thing to the wrong person you do the wrong thing to the wrong person now you don't have teeth do you understand you can't just do that life doesn't just come to you you, you need to be comfortable with struggling and pain or else next thing you know your children are always dependent on you and you're like oh my goodness they never grew up well yeah it's because of mommy that's <laughs> because you're babying your children you're not letting them fail and have to figure it out because true intelligence and true strength is gained through failing Right? How do you build muscles? Well, you have to go through pain. You have to go through struggle. And that's reality, man. That's life. But estrogen's always typically... It's not too bad as if she doesn't go too far if there's a man there in that home because he's going to balance that out. right? Because there is a lot of times and places where being soft and things like that is great for the children. But when it's just her, it just works. It's, it's just terrible. The children never leave the home. The children have children. The children's children are broken. Everyone's broken, depending on where it started from you, right? Which is now, I think, like the grandma, right? Because you were babying your kids, and then that cycle continues, all right? So just regular stuff, all right? So now let's get let's get into this, okay? Who are you? Let's uh let's increase this right here. For me, um. Uh was that 1990 something graphics? <laughs> That's as good as we can get. I told you so. I told you that I was living with a lot of men. I don't even know what a man looks like. And where have you been? Your uncle's been worried sick because you didn't come home. I couldn't come home. He didn't want to say anything, Mr. Coburn, but she got kind of fly eyes. I did not. They stabbed me and they wanted me to be a corpse, and they forced me in, and I was unconscious. Oh, what's he said? There was one policeman in the room, and I was like, catch a ball in my front, and then they tried to drown me. Can't make that up. Oh, we're crazy about her, Mr. Coburn. So this is the bath crazy idiot from Bellevue, is it? And these are the two. She said, "I don't think anyone likes me." Daddy, aren't you ashamed of yourself? Daddy, wasn't get so excited. I'm not. I think you're only able to hear out of one earphone because I am as well too. But we gotta just make it do what it do. I don't shout to. Just be very quiet. We're going to have a baby. What? I told you so. I told you so. Oh, Daddy. Oh, Daddy's confused, Mr. Coburn. I'm the one. Have a baby. Have a cigar. No, thank you. I don't want a cigar. All I want is my daughter to get out of this place. Daddy, go get your things to me. <laughs> All right. Typical, typical estrogen cries in two seconds over nothing. But at least they know her traditional role. Like, go get the whatever. <laughs> and then she just goes and gets it. I always remember, man, estrogens can cry, like, in two seconds, man. So their tears are not worth the same as a man's tears. Like, they'll break a nail and cry. The world's getting smaller all the time, honey. Now you just keep thinking of that. Hmm. Let's get stuck. No, you're not you ready. Mr. Coburn, I can't go now. I'm all wet. Absolutely right, Miss Foster. Absolutely you right. You sleep it without Mr. Coburn. We'll take care of her. Thank you. Come on, daddy. <laughs> Goodbye, happy time. He just slapped her in the face like it was just regular because it was back then. But it was softly. Let's not be let's not be beta males. <laughs> Goodbye, Daddy. Bye, God. Thanks for everything, Daddy. Well, honey. Give our regards to Oaksville. Come on, Daddy. Just like I did a video, which I might do on the end screen. American history, uh, spanking wives or something like that. Man, it was just regular. You just spank your estrogens. And spank just estrogens out of, out of control. I've got something very important to tell you, Mama. You need to make you mad at me. Daddy, come on. I don't know what she's there. Dumb little kid, isn't she? She <laughs> must be. The spirit says the one who saw the murder shall rise and walk slowly toward that worm and lick the daylights out of her. That's a good idea. This is for Norman. This oh. is for Daddy. <laughs> at, at, any, at any point, and that's the drink, it just gets spanked. That's just how it was back then. 
She did something. How do you do? How do you do? I'm Phillips, Mr. Kenny's man. Oh, yes, I remember you. Uh, this is uh, Phillips, Mr. Kenny's man. Oh, hello, Mr. Phillips. Mr. Kenny have a message for us? Yes, Mr. Kenny wants you all down in his apartment in half an hour. He does? How'd he say it? Yes, when he said it, was he mad or was he glad? I'm sure I do not analyze Mr. Kenny's inflections and cadences. In half an hour, if you please. Well, yes, sir, we'll be there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I wonder what he wants. His man didn't sound very enthusiastic. Oh, people's men never sound enthusiastic. That's why they're people's men instead of people. Well, what the heck? Let's go down and find out. We can't be in any worse shape than we are now. You said it. Well, that's just this guy spanked, and that was just regular. Oh. <laughs> so he so that was the one that spanked her if if, if i'm uh correct uh let me see was that the one that spanked her yeah because that's the guy in the tuxedo thing yeah so so boom I, I, exhibit a b c d e f g he spanks her she did something being an s you have to understand man estrogens don't care about being smart man i know that sounds crazy but it really is true, man. They don't really care if they don't really understand things that's going around them, man. They care way more about if there's a man that they love and that's strong that's with them. They don't really care. So she she's obviously portrayed as, you know, the estrogen that just doesn't know what's kind of going on. And, you know, she's just slow mentally. So she did something. Estrogens just do things that just don't make sense and stuff like that. And like a video, I had to private on my channel. But a man is supposed to be the emotional cage for an estrogen, man. They just do emotional stuff and don't know what they're doing. And they're waiting, right, begging pretty much for a man to come and go, no, enough, right, and spank him. So he did that. She did, you know, he, he had enough. He spanked her. And what did she say? She said, I like you. I like you. Right. So he's like, hmm. So, but, but he learns a valuable lesson right here. You go. <laughs> he's like, hmm. So if you put estrogens in their place, they like you. Yup, that's the game. That's how it works. As I always say, estrogens don't typically do things because it's the right thing to do. They do it because there's a consequence, especially if a man's giving them that consequence. They love, love knowing that they'll behave, misbehave and a man comes and just doesn't allow it. That is a turn on to them. It's just like it's a turn on when an estrogen like has uh, big balloons in the front and big balloons in the back. That's a turn on to estrogens. All right, we're different creatures. All right, so now let's move on to this, the last clip. Um, let's increase the speed on this. Where estrogens just know being bratty, doing those little things, they're just begging pretty much and pleading for a man to come and just put them in their place. It's, it sounds like they're the misogynists, but it's okay. Let's continue. You do not know these because, because you are new in the country and, and you do not understand, but I love these poor peasants and they need me. But I need you to, and I will follow you wherever you go. But you are so stubborn. And you have the head of a pig. And you are like a mule and like a donkey. And I... I love you. Uh, you do not understand. I cannot have a woman doing the things I do. You will not like that. Yeah. I must travel alone. Can you not live by doing something else? No. I live only to destroy those who take advantage of the poor people. Mm. When that is done, then... Then maybe I will settle down. But what becomes of me? I'm going to take you and your money back to the doctor. You can go on being the kind of a thief your father wanted you to be. Or uh, oh. you can learn to be honest and make the world a little more beautiful. And you are crazy. Go ahead and nurse the poor. I'll still be here when you get back. Go tell the doctor I changed my mind and he can tear up the deed. And stick a knife in his fat middle and cut your own throat. What? Do you want me to give you another spanking? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and that's, that's estrogens in a nutshell. Right, like they know, I know it's crazy, man. It sounds crazy, but they do things. Because they just want you to tell them to stop. <laughs> like it, it just is what it is. They don't have ambitions to go to the moon and stuff like that. Like they just want to know a strong man will just because like they're just they don't have the the, the components in their DNA to like check themselves. Like they don't have an, and they don't have a drive to want to do that. They want to be able to like just they can just release emotions but can't go too far. And then a man goes enough. And he just he just spanks her, man. Puts her in her place, and then you know she's just like, oh, he put me in my place. He's such a real man, and and that'll be the man that she's thinking about, man. You know, cause you know I get comments on you know beta males like blah 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 equal blah blah blah. Right, I know he's single. <laughs> I know he's single, and I guarantee you the majority of them have not ever made an estrogen waterfall. 
estrogens want to be beneath you. They do this little brattiness. They do these little things because they want you to put them in their place. It's just their nature. It's just what it is, man. It's not hate. It's just it just is what it is. And estrogens that are being honest will admit that. They test men because they deep down are finally trying to find that man that just won't put up with nonsense, won't put up her with being being irrational. And then check her. I think I did a, a community post and I posted this of an estrogen admitting like like um like going back and forth and arguing with estrogens like that's feminine because they know you're not supposed to do that. You're supposed to be like, look, this is how it's going. Blah, 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 blah. And then you just spank them. Right. They go, OK, <laughs> that's this is how they're wired, man. It just is what it is. A bear, you know, he eats, you know, beings, you know, if you leave it in the, you leave it in the neighborhood and estrogen desires to test a man to know that that man will put her in her place. It's just, it's just how they're wired. You know that spanking? Yes. No, he spanks her, man. Puts her in her place. And, and then, you know, typical estrogen, she, 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 he goes, you want me to spank you? She goes, yeah. And then she goes, ah, like t typical FIFA. See, if, if you don't know estrogen nature, man, you're like, what? You just said you want me to spank you. Then I spanked you. And then you scream that that's just how they are, man. Right, you know, and you know, let's not get into that other topic, but that's just how they are, man. They say one thing, but they want the other a lot of times. Ah. All right, so, you know, they rolled out. <laughs> so estrogen nature, man, the reason why estrogens crap test or they get bratty, man, is because deep down estrogens want to be put in there place which is beneath you it's your role to lead the home a relationship does not work nine times out of ten if the man is not leading the home it just is what it is if both genders don't come to that agreement they just need to sleep with each other but when if they're trying to be serious about a relationship it works when the estrogen submits and understands that that man is head of the home and if she misbehaves then there's consequences for it there's no, oh, I'm whatever you want, sweetie. Oh, you're just a queen. Whatever you do, you're just such a queen. You're just so amazing. Like, you're going to get divorced. <laughs> she's going to leave you for a guy that gives it to her rubbing the bed and is probably cheating on her because she's seeking for a man to be dominant. And those type of men typically have multiple different type of estrogens. You know, now she's going to ruin herself because now she's just sleeping with dudes that are masculine and dominant, but... He's in his phase of he just wants multiple different estrogens. So now, you know, next thing you know, she's 30 years old, right? So it's just the reality. It's just the truth, man. And if you're if when estrogens feel comfortable in conversations then they admit these type of things, but if, if they know like, oh, he's kind of like a beta male, then they won't admit these type of things, man. All right. So if you enjoyed the video, the thumbs up, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think down below. And I'll see you guys later. We out. <gasps> Peace. Man, ice cold with the hose, man. Need pussy no relation Then send them back to their boyfriends Come me the snowman Ice cold with the hose man Need pussy no relation Then send them back to their boyfriends Leave her chilly without jackets, I'm the snowman Caught a squad doing trains, we run slaves